Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Bad Unboxing. Today we're going to unbox three cans. We have a can of chili, a can of beans, and a can of Chef Boyardee spaghetti with meatballs. We're going to taste test all three. I'm going to give you my review at the end of the show. Uh, so let's get started. The first one we're the, that we're going to take a look at is the can of refried beans. These are Ros Rosarita can fried beans. And uh, I don't have uh, a normal can open opener, so I'm going to use... The one that came with the food. Alright, so this one is going to be a little bit tricky to get out because there's a sort of a suction process with uh, refried beans. Uh, now, see, normally you'd, you'd, un you'd untop it and then you just get goo that leaks out. And then it doesn't come out. You have no solution. I'm going to show you a solution. You get a sharp knife, you get something sharp, and you do this to the bottom of it. Just like that. And that's how you do it. You can do a similar thing with cat food if you have a big cat food or a big cat. Uh, you can do a similar thing with the cat. So we're gonna we're just gonna take a little bit off the top. Hmm. That's actually really good. I'm gonna go in for seconds. The thing you gotta understand about refried beans is that they're refried. They're actually fried twice. The first time, it doesn't go well. That's why they need to fry it the second time. So you're always gonna be eating beans that, are, that they have been through some trauma. Now, the second thing that we're gonna go with is the chili. I gotta say that the refried beans were probably seven out of 10. I'm gonna hope that Cattle Drive Gold is going to fulfill me. Fulfill me in my primal needs. My primal needs is meat because meat does body good. Now, the thing about chili is it, uh, it reacts somewhat similarly. It does have a suction, but not as much of a suction. So it's gonna do what it does best, but in case it's not flowing like it should be, you can drop it like it's hot. All right, so now this is looking a little bit more appetizing now that we got like some actual meat in here. Actually, this might be meatless. Mmm, you know what? It, it isn't meatless. It has meat. But when it's cold, it's kind of hard to know what meat. I like to heat meat up just to, so I can sort of taste flavors better. Hmm. I think it's 17 proof. Oh, oh no, oh no, no. <laughs> now we're gonna move on to Chef Boyardee's SpaghettiOs. These are gluten-free and they end child hunger. Oh. Uh, Chef Boyardee's mini spaghetti is uh, kind of it's kind of like the rest of it, uh, in, in, in where you have to insert. Sometimes it takes more than one hit. that was a successful transfusion. I hope you guys learned a lesson from it. Now, this one I am skeptical about. I think it's made for kids, so it's not going to be as refined. Mmm. It's good. It's really good. I like this. You got to be careful when you're dealing with the leftover cans, because sometimes it leaves a sharp, a sharp rim. But, uh, I'm, I'm pretty safe because I'm not too afraid of rim jobs. Um... Timothy Turnpike didn't didn't die for our sins so that we would waste food. This food isn't going to waste. As soon as I'm done with the video, I'm going to keep eat, eating it. I might save some of it uh, in, in, a, in a bottle somewhere. One thing that the other YouTube guys don't do right is they don't eat all the food in their videos. 
like I do. It's not illegal to eat cold spaghetti, okay? Yo, it's cold spaghetti. We speak on spaghetti. It's farming on a sweat of spaghetti. Mom's spaghetti. He's nervous, but on the surface, he looks cold spaghetti. You try okay, guys, I couldn't find any parody songs about eating beans, so I'm just gonna move on to the chili. Chili, chili, chili. Turn around. Chili, 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 chili. Touch the ground. Chili, 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 chili. Come on, dance around and play that song. Sugar, Philly, and out of my thong. Chili, 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 chili in my belly. Chili, 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 belly. Oh, a ch chili, chili, chili. Hands, hands up, chili, chilies. Um, <clears throat> hey, we're almost done, guys. We're almost done with it. All right, guys. Thank you so much for watching. This has been another episode of Chili Chili. I hope you liked it. I hope you favorited it. I hope you put it on five stars. Uh, if you put it five stars on Netflix, your friends and family will be able to watch it. I like it. It's kind of like a surfboard, but sideways. So here's what the GOG gaming socks look like. It has their uh, main mascot root, uh, sort of a low poly version of root on the front, front of it. The free market will set you free. That's why they call it free market, because free market principles established in 1882. Now we're going to move on to the... Okay, yeah, yeah, no problem. You just want me to sort of classify the types of videos that I make? Okay, yeah, yeah, I, I would, you know, I'd call them short-form edutainment. Yeah, that's, that's why I call them. Short-form edutainment. I think, I think it's the type of thing that the kids these days are really craving for.